All right. Hey students, Mr. Flick here, and let's talk about the technology that you're going to use for your Tech Saves the World project or any of the other projects. For this example, I'm going to talk Tech Saves the World, but just change the idea over for digital literacy or for life skills, but you're going to get what I'm saying here. So what we're going to do here is you're going to pick one of the six strands to use the technology that you're going to use for your project. Okay, so let's review what they are. Uh, number one is filmmaking, and that could go in two different directions. That could go a documentary, so let's say, let's keep with the idea of sea turtles. Maybe it's this documentary all about sea turtles. It's facts, it's figures, it's beautiful images, and all this art that you find online and video clips that you've found. Really great stuff. So a documentary. Or you could do a dramatic film. So maybe it's a mystery all about someone who stole a sea turtle. Somehow you got to film it here in the classroom, and I don't know where you're going to get a sea turtle, and I don't really want to know where you got a sea turtle. But... That's what you could do. So dramatic film or a documentary film. So like nonfiction and fiction kind of, kind of thing. Okay. Um, so that you're going to be using things like cameras, tripods, lighting kits, uh, iMovie, uh, background music. You're going to do all sorts of great tech skills with, with filmmaking. Okay. Number two is digital music. Um, again, sea turtles. You could write a song about sea turtles. You got to create the, the beats the melodies, the lyrics for it. You can use a little help with AI if you want a little song about sea turtles or whatever you're doing. I'm just giving an example of sea turtles here. So you record it and you're able to perform it and you, you, you mix it all together with mixers and garage band and cables that go into microphones. A lot of cool technology with digital music. Okay. Uh, number three is uh, programming and game development. Now you mostly just Work, actually, you just work on a MacBook. There's no other external technology, but it's so cool because it's game development. You're going to make, okay, sticking with the sea turtles theme. Maybe it's all about a little hatchling that's got to get from its nest on the beach all the way to the beach, all the way to the water without getting seagulls that come down and eat it and crabs that want to steal it away. And maybe it's a little video game about that. And it's really cool programming that you're going to be doing. And then people test it and they've got to play your game and they're going to be like, hey, I got stuck here. Can you fix that? Or hey, you know, whatever. So you're going to do some really cool stuff with game development. Great, great programming with that. Love that one. Uh, number four is robotics. We got these new VEX robots that are really cool. You got to build it like an arm and all claws, and you're going to find tutorials on how to do all this. You're going to come up with an idea. Maybe it's a robot that cleans up the beach. It can go around on the beach, and it can sense where there's garbage, and it can pick up the garbage and put it into another container or something. I don't know. That's up to you to decide. But I'm just saying it's programming, it's building, it's engineering, it's testing. It's really cool technology, fun, and you're going to love that. Uh, number five is animation. There's three different ways you can go with animation. There's claymation hand-drawn animation or digital animation you can pick one of those and just really depending on which one you pick you know you got all these things you're going to use maybe it's clay maybe it's going to be working just on your macbook in digital animation but there's so many things to learn about the world of animation and then maybe you make an animated movie about sea turtles again don't know but maybe that's what you do and uh you know so that uh, you, know, you can maybe it's a documentary i don't know but there's so many creative ways to use animation. And finally, number six is podcasting. You guys know what a podcast is. You're going to get some microphones. You're going to get our new roadcasters that we have in here that are very nice. Plug it all in. Have headphones. Have guests. Have interview scientists. Do all this. Bring in all these things. Have a great series of podcasts. Maybe it's five episodes. Maybe it's six. Maybe it's 20. I don't know, but you're going to do these great podcasts for your entry uh, into the festival or for your other projects that you might be doing, whether it's for um, digital literacy or for life skills. But those are the six that we're going to be offering this semester, and we can't wait to see what you guys make with these. Okay, have fun.